You hid what you knew about the camera intervals, Shuichi. Gota! But Mew's silent about intervals, too. Unlike Shuichi, I actually have an airtight alibi. Kaito! Kaede backed up Shuichi's alibi, didn't she? Shuichi and Kaede weren't together the whole time, were they? Hirumi! Both of them were together when the receiver went off. If Shuichi had the receiver, it could have been disguised. Kibo! Kaede is the one who actually had the receiver. But that's Kaede's lie, isn't it? I'll do it! We'll know whether or not it's a lie when we talk this through. Everyone, you have to believe me. Shuichi is not the culprit. If we vote for Shuichi, we'll be making the wrong choice. And if that happens, everyone will be executed. I definitely won't let that happen, even if it costs me my life. Kaede. Yeah, it's just like Kaede said. Shuichi ain't the culprit. Gonta believe in Shuichi too. Gentlemen always believe in friends. Well, if Shuichi's not our culprit, then who is? We've already exhausted all possible avenues of discussion. No way. There has to be something else we can discuss. We just gotta think. Right, Shuichi? Huh? Shuichi, even though you're not the culprit, you've been quiet for a while. It's because you realized something, huh? You're scared to reveal the truth. <laughs> I thought so. Shuichi. Answer me this. What kind of truth did you realize? Don't be scared to say it. Not just for me, but for everyone else. Please, face the truth. The picture. Picture? The picture from the camera aimed at the hidden door, just before the murder. I always thought it was suspicious, the way Rantaro was acting. Hmm? What's suspicious? If you look at the picture, it looks like Rantaro is trying to remove the camera. But that must mean he noticed the camera we set up. That's true. But when did he notice that? I believe it was when the camera took its first picture. This picture was taken when Rantaro moved the bookcase. At that moment, Something made him notice the camera. So he tried to remove it, and that's when the bookcase closed. The sensor was triggered, and that's when this picture was taken. If that is the case, we must find the reason why he noticed the camera. You're confusing everyone! Except me, of course. Just get to the fucking point! I've been contemplating what it could be. Why did he notice the camera? And the answer is in this picture. I get it! Because of the flash, right? Yeah, the flash. Yes, the flash went off when the hidden door camera took a picture. Rantaro noticed the camera's flash. But how can you tell the flash went off? Well, if you compare it to the other pictures that we have. Remember the pictures that were taken when I took down the cameras? 
This is the picture taken when I removed the front camera. And this is the picture from when I removed the rear camera. And this is the picture of Rantaro. Whoa! The brightness is totally different! Same room, circumstance, and camera. And yet, there is a disparity in brightness. Because only the camera aimed at the hidden door had the flash turned on. What was the purpose of leaving the flash on? Especially since it was meant to be hidden. A mistake, maybe? It's no mistake. There was an objective here. That camera was placed for another reason. Another reason, huh? I get it! The flash was used to lure whoever moved the bookcase to the camera. So when the flash went off, they would have noticed the camera right away. And that's exactly what happened. Rantaro moved the bookcase, noticed the flash, and then walked over to the camera. But the culprit didn't expect the camera to take another picture when the door closed. Hey, Kaede? What is it? Is something wrong? You've been acting kind of strange. Strange? Your last few remarks carry more conviction than before. Do you know who the culprit is? Yep, I know. I've known for a long time. Hmm? Long time? Because there was only one person able to set the flash on the camera. Isn't that right, Shuichi? The culprit of this incident is... No doubt about it. Well, this is as far as it goes. I couldn't do it. I couldn't get to the mastermind. I'm sorry, everyone. I'm sorry, Rantaro. I'm sorry, Shuichi. You stayed silent this whole time because you realized it already, right? But you can't do that. It may be the end of me, but I want my wish to. I'm giving it to you, Shuichi. From now on, you're going to carry on my wish. You're going to protect everyone. Kaede, I know what you want me to do. That's so cruel. It's cruel, but... I understand. I'll do it. You can trust me. I won't let your wish... go ungranted. Kaede is the culprit. Huh? Kaede did it? Wait! That's not possible! Right, Kaede? Kaede? Wait! 
Did she really? <laughs> Just kidding. Just kidding? Huh? Did you guys really think I'm the culprit? Psh, come on, guys. Like I could. When Rantaro was murdered, I was in the classroom with Shuichi, remember? After that, we went to the library, and that's the first time I even saw his body. Plus, I never met up with Rantaro. I never had a chance to kill him. Yes, no way Kaede could be culprit. Jeez, of course not. Do you think I'm even strong enough to throw that shot? My hands are only strong enough to play piano. Then accusing you of being the culprit is... <laughs> yep, it's wrong. Shuichi's just joking around. He wanted to lighten up the mood. Right, Shuichi? No matter how you look at it, I couldn't have killed Rantaro with that shot. Not joking around. Kaede definitely killed Rantaro. What the hell did you just say? It seems as though Shuichi is serious after all. Of course I am. Why don't you tell me then? How did I kill Rantaro with that shot? Yeah, how? You and Kaede were together the whole time, weren't you? How Kaede killed Rantaro with the shot put ball should become clear when you consider where she used it. Where she used the shot put ball? Huh? What? I'm lost, you guys. I have an alibi. When Rantaro was killed, I was in the classroom standing watch with Shuichi. Kaede never saw Rantaro. Then how she kill him? It's important to establish where the culprit used the shot. We know that it was in the library. Rantaro was killed in the library after all. That's the only explanation. In which case, it's impossible for me to be the culprit. I have an alibi. When Rantaro was killed, I was in the classroom standing watching with Shuichi. Kaede never saw Rantaro. And how she killed him. It's important to establish where the culprit used the shot. We know that it was in the library. <laughs> That's wrong! Kaede didn't use the shot put ball at the scene of the crime. She used it at the first floor classroom, where we were keeping watch. Hold up. How could she have hit Rantaro with a shot from a different floor? She rolled it. She rolled the shot from the first floor classroom and hit Rantaro. I am skeptical that she could perform such a feat of accuracy. So it was a man. 
magic shot put ball? Ugh, that's not possible. It is possible. If you do it at the right spot in the classroom, it will reach the library. So it seems you already knew about that. The classroom's vent. If you were to roll the shot in there, it would reach the library. I see. That air duct connects the classroom to the library. So, the shot is rolled into the vent, passes through the duct, and comes out of the air vent above the library bookcase. Look at she have hit Rantaro from all the way over there! <laughs> 